Hi there, my name is Neve Murdoch. We are outside Ramsey Fire Station again today, covering the firemen's run. I'm here with Steve today, um, who is helping organise this event. So could you tell me, what's your position here, I suppose? Oh, position, well, I, I just sort of always help to organise this. Yeah. Um, for, God, donkeys, he's used to run in it. Um, yeah. You know, when I was fit, in, lived in Laxey, oh, so I was coming well, down. Still do I was coming down to run these in 19, uh, 1985. Everyone looks really keen to be running as well. Yeah, we're down a bit on numbers because there's other things on the the Young Farmers Concert. There's a fair few yes, different was. classes of other events now, you know. Mm. But um, uh, hopefully we'll, we'll go okay and we'll get the presentation done at the Mitre. <laughs> number 105 so George I hear that this is your personal best time yeah yeah it was do you know what time you got I got 11 minutes and 49 that's brilliant if you don't mind me asking how old are you I'm 17 17 because I remember that you have to be 16 and above to do this yeah so that's cool and um, what got you first interested in running well my dad used to be associated with the athletics club so that's how I got into it and then I don't know I just guess I carried on it's mainly for fitness though it's not yeah. competitive but yeah, enjoy doing it from time to time. We're here with Alan now. Uh, you were number 31, correct? Number 31, yeah. Now, if I remember correct, you came third today. I did come third, That yeah. is brilliant. Uh, this was third in the one lap race, yeah? The one lap race, yeah. yeah. So how did you find that? Is it your personal best? or? It is my personal best, yeah. Mm. I did 10 minutes, 14, 13, 14, 15, something like that. It was good. Um, back in October, about 10 minutes, 53. So yeah. come down a considerable chunk, which I'm happy about. Yeah. Have you been training in between then and now then? Yeah, I do a lot of training, yeah. yeah. Tried to go to Peel on a Tuesday night with Maggie Lockley. She does a training session there. Yeah. And uh, I like doing the belt leagues as well, the prom runs. So different things. How did you first get into it, if you don't mind me asking? Um, it was, this is my third season of doing the fireman runs and I started yeah. just at that. And I'm a fireman in Kurt Michael. Mm. And they're always threatening and bringing fitness policies and stuff. Yeah. And the rank I am in Kurt Michael, I've sort of got to be seen to be leading by example. Mm. And I knew at the time fitness wasn't on my side. I was a little bit heavier than what I am now. Mm. Um, so I thought I'd go for the big change. I lost two yeah. and a half stone, started running. Wow. And um, yeah, got the bug for it and started enjoying it. We're here with Will today. He's number 43, as you can see. And he has literally just finished the three lap race coming in first. So Will, how did you find that? Uh, yeah, it was tough. Um, <laughs> There, there was a bit of a slim field at the front. I think there might be a race this weekend that they're hoping to go well in, so a few of them are holding back. But there were two guys doing the, the one lap, who they helped me around that first lap, but then I was on my own for two laps. Yeah, so it's a lot of determination throughout that then. Yeah, I've been, um, been in limbo a bit between the, the, the fast guys at the front when I do this and then sort of everyone else. It's been quite hard to run on my own, but I've got a bit more used to it now. Um, I managed to hold the pace throughout. Normally I drop off on the last lap, yeah. um, but tonight I managed to hold it, which was nice. Second place in the handicap of the three lap is Dave Hodgson. Yeah. <laughs> 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 we all hand out. Um, this is in memory of Neil Walker, who, when he was at the fire station, he never missed a fireman's run. He was always out marshalling for us. He was really keen on the races. But unfortunately, in a, maybe three years ago now, lost his life in a motorcycle accident. Um, so his, his family wanted a trophy um, dedicated to the fireman's runs because he loved the runs that much and loved the enthusiasm that it all generated. Um, we tend to give the Walker Cup to somebody who's really tries hard all the time, doesn't necessarily win anything. Um, <coughs> this year, um, a guy that we've noticed quite a few years now, he, he, he sort of arrives up here on the bus and he, he does the runs and has his fish and chips and gets on the bus and goes all the way back again. But he hardly ever missed a park runs or a fireman's run in probably about the last five or six years. So we're delighted to award the Walker Cup this year to Colin Crooks. Thank you.